Jeffrey Zakarian and Aaron Sanchez. The chefs have finished cooking. The judges are back in the audience. They finished taste testing. We're going to see which of our two competitors today has got the competition in the bag. Now, gentlemen, before we hear what the, what the audience thought, let me just say whoever wins today, uh -huh. this part is the trophy. <laughs> and Rachel, this is not. Okay, Rachel. You when know what, Sonny? Like she tried to take, tell him, Sonny. I, did, I thought the whole thing was a trophy, so I just picked up the whole thing. I just was running around the studio. <laughs> <laughs> she was very excited. I was really excited. You know, when I watched that, I thought to myself, I have not yet grown up. You make me feel like a kid, and I appreciate that. And in a good way. Yes. So All right. I have a quick question. So yes. if whoever wins gets the guest host with you next time? Yeah, sure. Maybe? You Is that... You He's here all the time, I too. I know, all right. Well, we're we're like an that. open door for any foodie. Uh, all up on my territory, all up on my territory. So, okay, let's, let's remind everybody, Jeffrey, why don't you tell everybody what, what you prepared? Oh, you had uh, several dishes, actually. I had uh, several dishes. I had the carrots with a little brown butter, black pepper, and pickle juice. Thanks, everyone. And you took back the pickles? Yep. I took back the pickles because <laughs> cause I can. Yes, that's good. Uh, and then I had, uh, what else did I do? I did an omelet. I love omelets. It's like eggs to me are like everything. And people really like, right? Eggs, you can do and anything. And they're underappreciated. They're really underappreciated. So I made an omelet. I wish I had cheese. There was no I cheese. Know. It was a very small pantry. Yeah, we and uh, with some roasted red peppers, uh, mm. with a little olive vinaigrette. And then I did um, the pasta with the chorizo. I nice. said. Just leave that to me, chorizo, okay. sir. Chorizo, <laughs> chorizo yes. that I seared really hot. And I put the uh, shredded lettuce and get the lettuce Yum, cooked. Yum, I love, I love lettuce. shredded yes, lettuce cooked because it really is an amazing flavor. I love it. And that's all I had. Delicious. Thank you. <clears throat> so let's start with the commentary so we yes. can match it up. What did the audience have to say? Just give us a couple highlights. Iron yeah. Chef GZ, Jeffrey Zakarian. Laura said that your pickled carrots were amazing. More like a salad and it was filling. Really liked it. Joanna thought the eggs were a little runny, a little undercooked. That's, See, that's the, the way they're way supposed to be. Yep. Yes. Just so, just so that's what we you. have for you right. as notes, Jeffrey. Yep. Mm -hmm. That's it. My husband, that's the only way he'll eat them. I love my eggs a little bit undercooked yeah. as well. I like them wet. We talked about this on yeah. the side of the yeah. kitchen. I really think that a good chef can be judged by their eggs. So I, I will defend your eggs, but you know, my girl, Joanna, might be right. <laughs> <laughs> might I don't remind right. everybody what you made. Very clever. Oh, no. Yeah, I, I, I made some stuffed lettuce uh, wraps with the chorizo. I took some of that rice. Mix that in there, and then that curveball, the ham salad, also found its way inside of those little parcels of love. Uh, and then I just made a, a red pepper sauce mm -hmm. right on the bottom, just sort of kind of bring it's it all really together. It's really pretty. I must it say. was pretty. Thank you. Thank you very much. Beautiful. Yeah, Jeezy made a lot of dishes, and you made a very like creative dish. So I, had, I really don't know. This is neck and neck. Yeah, and I also yeah. made some carrots really quickly with some of the fat of the chorizo, and then oh. added some sugar to sort of sweeten, salt it up. Salt and fat <sighs> can't beat that. Nice. I know you sound <laughs> very intimidated. I can tell. I am. There you go. <laughs> Well, all right. right, Chef Aron, so your notes from the judges that were the audience with the bags that you chose from. Cassandra said, your carrots were delicious, they weren't too sweet, and the chorizo was great. Mm -hmm. And then Daria said that she expected more spice. What's up with the heat? And that the dish was a little bland. Wow. We well, didn't have a, other than the chorizo, you really that didn't That was have pretty any. much all the spice they that you had. They both had such limited pantries. Yeah, you yes. had to do what you had to do. Yes. So, who is going to take the back. You guys ready to find out? We're ready. Who the winner of the second Good luck. ever. Good luck. In the bag competition. Oh, yeah. You're going to have to bring this to the set, GZ. All right. You guys. Yeah. Nice one, son. I don't think they'll love you. It's heavy. Don't tell me. Coming to the set of the kitchen. Yeah. Here's Michael Simon. <laughs> so thank you, of course, to Sonny, to Jeffrey, and at home. Don't forget to tune in to see Sonny and Jeffrey and our trophy on Food Network's The Kitchen. Yes. Uh, that's Saturday mornings, correct? 11 a.m. Food Network. Food Network. And if you're coming to New York City, be sure to check out Jeffrey's restaurants, uh, the Lambs Club, uh, and the National uh, and Dining Rooms coming soon. And in the spring, check out Aron's newest restaurant. Where Allegri. is it and what is it? It's going to be on the, on the Lower East Side called Allegri. Nice. Allegri. And see us on Chop, Jay-Z and I. And see you on Chop, right, guys? Yep. Awesome. We'll see everybody when we see you. Bye. Congratulations again, Jay-Z.